Hey, you! Yeah, you! Did you know that I, Ethan Nesser Crank Gameplays, am going on tour? What? On tour? That's right! I'm going on tour, and tickets are on sale right now. Go to I have to do this dot show. I'll see you in Toronto, Ontario, Royal Oak, Michigan, Cleveland, Ohio, Columbus, Ohio, Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, Indianapolis, Illinois, Minneapolis, Minnesota, Chicago, Illinois, Milwaukee, Wisconsin, Iowa City, Iowa, Raleigh, North Carolina, Nashville, Tennessee, Orlando, Florida, Atlanta, Georgia, Washington, D.C., Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, New York, New York, Boston, Massachusetts, Massachusetts, Portland, Maine, Los Angeles, California, Tempe, Arizona, Dallas, Texas, Houston, Texas, Austin, Texas, Oklahoma City, Oklahoma, Kansas City, Missouri, Boulder, Colorado, Salt Lake City, Utah, San Francisco, California, Seattle, Washington, Portland, Oregon, and Vancouver, British Columbia. I'm going all over the place, all across the U.S., and a little bit of Canada. A few shows have already sold out, so get your tickets now before it's too late. I'll see you on tour. Hello, and welcome back to the game that started it all. I played Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach recently, and I I did not like it. <laughs> it was just a broken game, and just, just a bad game overall, in my opinion. I thought it deviated way too far from the original idea, not in a good way. Uh, I didn't think it was scary. I, I, I just was really not impressed, and I was really pretty disappointed in Security Breach, but with that being said, uh, I thought that maybe I would take the opportunity to go back to the origin of Five Nights at Freddy's. Five Nights at Freddy's, because I haven't played this game, I think since it came out, which was 2014. Uh, so, I thought that we'd play some FNAF, just probably the first couple nights, however long this recording is, because I'm probably not gonna do more than this one recording. Um, but if you go down in the description, you can find the original FNAF playlist with all of my my first reactions and everything. Oh yeah, baby. This is what it is all about. This is going to be extremely annoying because my mouse keeps going off screen. But that is A-OK. -okay. There they are. Hello, hello. Uh, I wanted to record a message for you. Damn. The OG, um, baby. They, I wonder if they've added anything. Nothing to worry about, dude. I'll be fine. I'll be so fine. Let's just focus on you I'll be fine. Okay? Uh, let's see. First, there's an introductory greeting from the company. Introductory That's greeting from the company. Wonderful. Kind of Fantastic. Thing. Look at these guys. Um, See, like, even the the Magical art and the textures, it was so much more gritty and so much more creepy. The new one is, like, too polished and nice looking to where it just doesn't look good at all. Or, like, it doesn't look scary at all. It looks good. Um, like, it's pretty, but it, that's not really what it should be, in my opinion. Like, this had so much charm because of the grit and because of how simple it was. The open world ish feel of the new game just doesn't work. In my opinion. Those same stupid songs for 20 years, and I never got a bath, I'd probably be a bit irritable at night, too. Damn. So remember, I love the... hold a special place in the hearts of children, and we need to Damn. show them a little respect. It's good stuff. Right? It's good okay. stuff. And it, so it's nice to be reminded, I know that I'm talking over the dude. Uh, they're left in some kind of free-roaming mode at night. Mm. Something about their servos locking up, they get turned mm -hmm. off for too long. Damn. They used to be allowed to walk around during the day, too. But then there was the bite of 87. Yeah. The bite of 87? It's amazing that the human body can live without the frontal lobe. You know? Oh, wow. Now, now, concerning your safety, the only I'm already at 79%. It's just not great. If any, is the fact that these characters, uh, if they happen to see you after hours, mm -hmm. probably won't recognize you as a person. Ah, uh, yes. They'll, they'll most likely see you as a metal endoskeleton. I I wonder if this was improvised or to forcefully stuff you inside a Freddy Fazbear suit. 
like wow. if this was scripted or not, or if this was just whoever did the narration being like, eh. Especially around the facial area. So you can imagine how having your head forcibly pressed inside one of those could cause a bit oh, of yeah. discomfort. It, w it would be that. uncomfortable. Uh, the only parts of you that would likely see the light of day again would be your eyeballs and teeth that pop out the front of the mask. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they don't tell oh. you these things when you sign Do up. Do you hear the dum dums? But hey, first station of the breeze. I'll chat with you tomorrow. Uh, check those cameras and remember to close the doors only if absolutely necessary. Yeah. There right. we go. See, even already, like I've played this game before. I played this game when it first came out. I know what to expect. But even still, like it's creepy and it's unsettling. It's really unsettling. And that was like such a big thing, like the darkness. What lies beyond in the darkness? Up, oh, there we go. Bonnie's out. Oh, fucking a. Um, like, not knowing... Oh, God. Not knowing what's... What lies in the dark. It's spooky, dude. It's super spooky. Oh, fuck. Alright, I need to be checking more around here. Oh! Whoa! 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 What? This literally... <laughs> That's never happened. That's never happened to me. Whoa! That's that was cool. That's literally never I've never gotten Golden Freddy. I mean, that's pretty random, isn't it? I know that there's a probability of like that happening, and I know that people know what it is. What's the probability of getting Golden Freddy on the first night? Wow, that's crazy or unimpressive. I don't know. That was cool. I've never had that happen. And once that happens, you're kind of just fucked, aren't you? Like, there's not really anything that you can do after that. See, what is the dum-dum-dums? I don't even know what they are. Oh, and that sound? That, like, uh, sound? You know what I'm talking about? Y'all know what I'm talking about. The uh, very fun, very fun. See, like, I don't know. It was just something about it. Um, and I didn't get super into the lore of the rest of the games. This game in FNAF 2 and was three sister location. I think it was three was sister location, right? Those are really the only ones that I like really played through. I don't even know if I beat FNAF 4. I can't remember. Um, and honestly, I don't even know how many games there are now. Just because after the first few, I was like, eh, yeah, I get it. Um, because I do think that it got a bit repetitive. And specifically with FNAF, I just didn't really care about the lore all that much, honestly. Um, but I had a point, and I don't remember anymore. So that's good. Very good. Very good job, me. Very good job. This, like, it brings me back a little bit to 2014 when this game came out. And I remember, and it, who knows what would have happened. Because I think there's a lot of YouTubers that, that they don't owe FNAF their success by any means. But, you know, FNAF was a huge game for them. Huge, huge, huge. Like, FNAF was gigantic for Mark. Um, and I remember that night, I, uh, I recorded the first episode, and it was pretty late already. Um, and I recorded the first episode, and I got it up, and it was already doing pretty good. And then I, I was gonna get up the next morning and record the entire game. I woke up at like 4 a.m. Um, I barely got any sleep at all. Um, and I was gonna wake up super early to record. Um, and my computer blue screened and it like, it was, it was blue screen for like two or three days, I think, where I just could not figure out what was going on. Um, and it like really fucked up my, my FNAF playthrough. 
Um, and so, like, who knows what would have happened if, uh, if that hadn't happened. Like, maybe FNAF would have been really huge for my channel. I have no idea. But it brings me back a little bit, for sure. Brings me back a little bit, for sure. And I also know, like, I really shouldn't be checking doing the lights and stuff as much as I am. I don't remember what that is. Oh, was that just ambience? Or was that a bad? I do not remember. I do not remember. See, it's like, even right now, my hands are fucking sweating. Because it's spooky. And that's just, like, really what sucked about the new FNAF. Like, it wasn't scary. Like, there were parts where the, the jump scares were good, or there were a couple creepy points. But it wasn't like this. You know, it didn't have this same feeling. I wasn't unsettled the entire time that I was playing it. I was more... Actually, Ashley Roboto put it great last night uh, we were talking about FNAF. She put it really great. The scariest thing about the new FNAF game was the thought of losing progress so you had to play it again. And that truly was the scariest thing about that game was the thought of of losing your progress and having to do it again. Where are you, Bonbon? Bon? Ah, there's a Chica, I believe. Oh, yep, there's, there's Bonnie there. We've got her. There was a bit of strategy that I never, what was that noise? That I never quite picked up in FNAF. Like, Mark was super good about, like, switching through the cameras and shit. And I never... I never really got that flow down, you know? Alright. Oh. Hi, Bonnie. Still there. Nope. Bonnie, please. Please go away. There we go. Bye bye, Bonnie. God. Hello? 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 Ugh, that noise I hate. The I have no idea where Chica is. I have no clue. Oh! Oh! There it is, 6 a.m. on the first night. Oh, the hands are sweaty, dude. Second night. This is fun because there's no pressure here to like beat a night or whatever. Like I'll stop recording whenever I feel like it because I've already played through this entire game. Already, dude? Hey, wh what happened to my boy? I did. Uh, I did, sir.
just to make sure everyone's in their proper place. You know? Yeah, everyone's for so, sure in their proper place. Interestingly enough, Freddy himself doesn't come off stage very often. No? Uh, he becomes a lot more active in the dark, though. So, hey, I guess that's one more reason not to run out of power, right? Uh-huh. Uh, uh -huh, I also want to emphasize the importance of using your door lights. Ah. Uh, there are blind spots in your camera view, and those blind spots happen to be right outside your doors. So if, if you can't find something or someone on your cameras, uh, be sure to check the door light. Uh, you might only have Great. a few seconds to react. Uh, not that you would be in any danger, of course. Uh, oh no, never. That. We'd never be in any uh, danger. Also, Check That's Freddy Fazbear's pizzeria. The character in there seems unique in that he becomes more active if the cameras remain off for a long mm -hmm. period of time. Uh, I guess he doesn't like being watched. I don't know. Uh, anyway, I'm sure you have everything under control. Uh, oh, yeah. Talk to you soon. Oh yeah, I got everything under control. What was your name? I can't remember what that dude's name was. I don't like the dum 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 dee dee dum. It's unsettling. It's unsettling. Celebrate. Yes. Yes, celebrate. Celebrate for sure. The to the day. It's my day. What did those things say? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, there she is. Oh yeah, there kid. Bonnie, where are you? Oh my god. Close. Jesus Christ. I hate how... How Bonnie just spawned in right as I was doing that. That was terrible. That was awful. Hi, Chica. Hey, Cheeks. How you doing? How you doing? What the hell is Bonnie? Bon Bon. My sweet bonbon. I also forget, do they only come in from certain sides? I don't... I don't remember, because obviously that's not true in the more recent games. Um, but I, I couldn't remember if that was a thing in this first game, where, like, only Bonnie came in from the left and only Chica came in from the right. I do not remember. I do not remember. Bonnie's so active. Bonnie's so active. You know, getting... Getting their steps in. Getting their steps in. Chica, where are you? Nothing so far. Nothing... Thus far. Spencer's yelling. Why is Spencer yelling? I don't know. You probably couldn't hear it in the mic. But Spencer was yelling about something. And I don't know what it was. Is Chica here? What is he yelling about? What is that dog yelling about? He's saying boo roo roo. I'm. This game also, I think if you pressed escape, it would just quit the game instead of pausing it, which was also terrifying. All right, 3 a.m., 47 percent. Not too too bad. Oh, cheekers. Where are you at? Where you at, Cheekers? I wanna know. I wanna know what love is. And I want you to show me. So you'd be sick to have a custom keyboard for this game? To just pull everything up with crazy speed? People have probably done that, yeah? I bet. Someone's done it out there. Someone's had to have. Ugh, God. The sound. 
The sound design is is really good in this game. Like it's it's very 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 fitting. And a, a lot of the sounds are. Uh... Oh. Chica's gonna be coming up in just a second, and also maybe Bonnie. Come on. I'm also just worried about fuck. I'm worried about my uh, my mouse just slipping. Faster, please. Nope. Okay. Whoo! Okay, 17% left. It's 5 a.m. though. 5 a.m. still. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Where's that sweet ring-a-ding-ding? -ding? Where's that sweet ring-a-ding-ding -ding of the alarm clock? Come on now. You know you want to give it to me. You know you do. Oh, oh the ring-a-ding-ding! -ding. You love to see it. You love to see it. Oh, God. Third night. 12 a.m. 12 a.m. Anything for my friends here? Mm-hmm. Hello. Hello. Hello, hello. Hello, hey, hello. Great. Thank you. Know, you. Most people don't last this long. I mean, you know, what do you they mean? usually move on to other things. What do you mean by that? Oh, so this job is just a stepping stone for most people. Well, I'll have you know that I take my work very seriously, and I will be loyal to this company. Hey, listen, I had an idea. If you happen to get caught and want to avoid getting stuck into a Freddy suit, try playing dead. You know, go limp. Then there's a chance that maybe they'll think that you're an empty costume instead. Then again, if they think you're an empty costume, they might try to stuff a mental skeleton into you. I wonder how that would work. Y yeah, never mind. Scratch that. It's best just not to get caught. Um, uh, okay, I I'll leave you to it. See you on the flip side. Great. Sorry that I keep taking my headphones off. Spencer is barking at something, and I don't know what. But again, I'm afraid to pause the game. Because, well, I don't want to lose progress. You know? Who knows how many nights we could be here? Who knows? Did they also. I can't remember. They had a sixth night, right? But they didn't have any. They didn't have any custom modes in this game, I don't think. Because in the other ones, you could do like 20, 20, 20, 20 mode or whatever. Come on, Chica, I want you to show your pretty face to me. But in, like, a nice way, not in a shitty way, you know? Oh, there you are! Chica, my favorite. My favorite gal, look at you. Beautiful as ever. Beautiful as ever. You always come to see me. 
and you are such a joy to have around. Always such, uh, such a, such a thankful guest whenever you come over. You always offer, hey, should I bring wine? Should I bring, you know, a salad? And I always say, no, we've got it covered. But it's nice that you ask, you know, Chica? It's nice that you ask, because sometimes people don't. Sometimes, sometimes people don't. Oh, 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 I didn't like that. Did not like that at all. There's, there's cheekies. There's good old cheekies. I really shouldn't even be using. Oh, okay. Chica. Chica. Hello. Ah, oh, there you are. Been waiting for you. Been waiting for you to peek your cute little head out here. That cute little face of yours, you know. Always so pretty. Mm -hmm. And always so done up. You know. You got your lip gloss on. You got your... Oh, there you are. She, cut. Look at you. Oh, look at those papers. Look at those papers. And that beak. Oh. Hey, Foxy. What's up, dude? What's up, my guy? Oh, God. There's still so much time for you to come out here. And I... I... Honestly, Foxy, you're kind of a uh, little bit of a buzzkill sometimes. If I'm, if I can be honest, if I can be honest with you, sometimes you're a little bit of a buzzkill because you come to the parties uninvited, all the time uninvited, and it sucks, dude. Because like I'd love to have you, I'd love to have you over. But it's almost the principle of the matter at this point, where it's like, I'm not gonna invite you if you're just gonna sh show up every time. And you always show up drunk, Foxy. You always show up drunk. And you make it everybody's problem. And that's the thing. That's the thing about it, is... If you didn't show up just blasted all the time, then it might be fine. You know? It might be fine, but you do over and over and over again, and it's just a bummer. Hey, Chica, love you, love you, mean it. But can you leave? Actually, that'd be dope. Actually, if you if you left, I'm sorry, and I don't again. I don't want to be an asshole about it any of this, but... Okay. <laughs> Does Foxy always come from the left, too? See, so guys, it's been such a long time since I have played this game. Or kind of done like anything FNAF related. On the housetop, ra -pa -pa. here comes dear old Santa Claus. Oh, what I need to actually find out a little. Okay, I saw. 
I saw Bonnie. Yep. There we go. And Freddy's out too, so that's cool. Chica, chica, pica. Chica, chica, pica. Ooh. I am not doing too hot on uh, on power right now, actually. That was the one thing that I kind of forgot about. Oh, God. Oh, shit. Go away. Go away. Go away. Fuck. Fuck. That was good timing! Very good timing. Very, very, very good timing. Oh, my God. Oh, boy. We've only died once, right? Yeah, it was only from the Golden Freddy at the very beginning. Which I've never gotten. That was really cool, actually. That was special. I don't think I ever got it, at least. I'm almost positive I did. I mean, especially in the first night. That was, oh my god, Foxy, you're already out. What the fuck? What the hell, dude? Holy shit. This is, this is night four. So, you know. I guess I... Wait, what happened? Oh no, oh no, I accidentally clicked off screen. Oh no, oh no. Please don't die, please don't die, please don't die. Uh, bring me back! Thank you, Jesus. That was bad. That was very, very bad. Oh, hold on. Chica's gonna be here. In just a second, I guarantee you. I guarantee. There she is there. And she is so pretty again, guys. The looks can't be compared. Cannot be compared. Dude, I cannot believe that Foxy is out so fast. Oh, you're so fast, aren't you, Foxy? Oh, you're so, you're so quick out there. You and you. There she is. Oh, double? Double? Double time, dude? Chica, can you leave? Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Fuck. Also, I feel like Freddy is probably. We might see him out and about. We might see him. Oot in a boot. You know, as the Canadians say. Fuck. 
for Edward. Freddy Fazbear. Oh, you big faz hunk. You big hunk of fluff, you. Okay, 3 a.m., 47%, uh, okay. Oh, fuck. I gotta be careful. Hey, Foxy, will you go back in your little... Fuck my ass, dude. That was... That was terrible. Oh my god, I hated that. I really hated that. Oh my god, Chica. Chica Bobica. So much, so much to do, you know? God, will you change, please? There you go. All right, 30%. I don't know about this, guys. Come on now. Bon! You killing me, guy. You killing me. Bonnie! Finally. Okay. 19%. This is not great. Go away. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh boy. Oh boy. Eight percent, dude. I might. I might be fucked. I might be completely boned. Come on. Come on. 5 a.m. Come on. Come on. This is the stressful shit. <laughs> oh my god! How did he even get in? <sighs> my art! My art, my art. We played for a good, oh, I've been recording for 45 minutes. There we go. First four nights, I feel like that's a solid video. We all know how the game goes. I don't need to complete the whole game, at least in my opinion. I've already done it. So if you want to check out my full FNAF series from 2014, I'll leave the playlist down below. But thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know how it was to revisit because it was kind of fun for me. It, it made me remember why the game was so special in the first place because it was really special and it was really significant. Even if you didn't enjoy the game, I think that there's, it goes without saying that it was a very significant game in the horror genre period, but especially in the in the indie scene. Um, like FNAF is, is such a gigantic franchise now and it's cool to 
go back to where it started. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure to slap that like button right in the face. And I will see you guys in the next video. Love you all. Stay cranky. Bye. What is up with the cranky crew?